time has run out for Iran. That is the warning from Israel's president as six world powers met today with Iranian negotiators in Moscow. This is the third round of talks called after two previous rounds of discussions uh, yielded uh, little results. Israeli President Shimon Peres, he's weighing in during an exclusive interview with our Elise Labitt. She's joining us live from Jerusalem. Uh, Elise, first of all, it seems as if he's got some pretty strong, tough words here. Uh, what did he say? How did he weigh in? That's right, Suzanne. Uh, the president spoke to us on the eve of his uh, annual conference looking at the challenges facing the world and, and how to make a better world. And as those talks start in uh, Moscow on Iran, he said that he thought Iran was playing for time and that he, the Iran just didn't think the world was serious enough about dealing with their nuclear program. Let's take a listen to what he said. Do you think the military threat is credible enough? I think, I hope that the Iranians will understand it's credible enough. If the Iranians will understand seriously that this is an option, maybe you shall not need it. If they'll think that this is a bluff, then it may lead to a war. For that reason, the warning must be credible. The sanctions must be credible. So let's first of all use the non-military means, indicating to the Iranians, gentlemen, better you'll agree with a non-military confrontation than look for other options. How long do they have? How long? I think time is out because they continue to build the bomb. So it's not a pause. They continue to do things which are contrary to the United Nations resolutions, to the Atomic Center in Geneva. They build, they provoke. But they say, okay, we stop. And maybe the West would have a problem. They don't. They continue to enrich the uranium. So you cannot provoke the world assuming that the world is made of fools only. So time is out, you're saying? This is it? I think time is beginning to be out, yes. And Susan, I have to tell you, uh, Shimon Perez is really one of the strongest so-called doves here in Israel. And to hear him talk in very real terms about a military option was really striking. On this front, he said that President Obama needs to show American leadership here. He said American needs to be the, quote, elder statesman on this issue and that the U.S. can't um, hand Iran, a nuclear Iran, uh, the entire Middle East. So really looking, uh, I think, for the U.S. to join them in, in making this credible threat. 